has the properties, well, the really abilities of the Enderman, so it's kind of hard to actually kill one of these guys, and I find it's quite very annoying. Very cool, very simple, and it, it gives you like an Enderman type feel, and I think that's a... What's up guys, welcome to another Minecraft mod review. Today's mod is the teleportation mod. Now what this mod does is it adds in several new blocks into your Minecraft game as well as a mob which I will show you in a second. Some cool teleportation wands which makes your life a lot easier and a teleportation dimension. Now I know you guys enjoyed the dimension mods and this is actually a very 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 cool mod. In addition to the actual dimension they have these very cool wands. Now I'm not going to be showing you guys any of the recipes in this uh, video mainly to save time but in the forms they have all the recipes available and it's very easy to craft and whatnot. so yeah let's move on. First off here we have two new ores added into the Minecraft game. We have the teleportation ore which is the blue one here and then the Trenti uh, Trentor ore. Now this could be found in the nether and this could be just be found in the overworld. You just dig down and you find it randomly. Now you can ha harvest those both with a wooden pickaxe and anything above that. You don't need a iron pickaxe or anything like that. You just need you know wooden for the basic uh, mining process. Anyways we also have a, a new step block and a new actual block. Now to craft your portal will just use the Trentian blocks in the shape of a normal nether portal. Now once you're in the um, Trentian, well excuse me, once you're in the teleportation dimension you will find two new blocks that is ad added into the game, excuse me. They will be the grass block and the dirt block and also you will have a new mob which is called the spawn, well excuse me, it's called the TP mob. And now the TP mob draw, well I don't, I'm not sure why these spawns but once we get into the actual dimension I will spawn in another one to really show you guys um, what that is. Anyways guys, let's move on to the wand before we actually go into the portal itself. Now first off here we have the actual portal wand. Now there's two of these but this one is actually actually the official portal wand. And what this does is, let's actually get a new one because I already used it. Now let's get one here, oh, okay there we go. Now what the teleportation wand does is that once you have this in your hand and you've never used it before, I have to emphasize this that once you have this in your hand, you do not want to use it in any way until you're absolutely sure that you want to set your location. And what, by that I mean, once you have this wand in your hand, you could set your location and wherever you are on the map, you can um, right click again and it will uh, send you back to that location. So let's say I want to set my location um, right here at uh, on top of the grass block over here and just right click on it and it'll, it'll just, it won't, nothing will pop up in your screen, it'll just um, show that you've used your wand, you'll see this um, usage line, just go down, your durability go down and basically what you've done is set your position at the top of the block, now you can only set your position once, but once you have your spawn position set, all you have to do is just right click and you'll teleport back to the spawn that you set. So pretty cool guys, moving on to the second teleportation wand or the seeing wand. Now what this allows you to do is to anywhere you're looking in your Minecraft game, doesn't matter how far it is, as long as your render distance at, is at a very high level, which I should probably change mine to a pro possibly medium level to really test this out. Well, you can use it at any um, view distance you want, but basically what this does is it allows you to teleport to the location that you're looking in. So I want to teleport to that cactus here. Let's just ca teleport and there you go. I'm dying now. Also, let's go to the water. If you, I'm not sure if you could go to the water exactly. Yeah, you, pop, you can't go into the water, but you can teleport to any other block. Let's go on top of that tree. There you go, guys. Very cool, very simple, and it, it gives you like an Enderman type feel, and I think that's the purpose of this actual um, wand. Okay, guys, last but not least, we have the portal teleportation wand, which ends out um, all of our wands. Basically, what this does is teleports you to the nearest nether portal in your actual overworld. So if you have a portal made somewhere and you just want to go through that portal very quickly and very fast. You can just hold this in your hand, right click and it will teleport you to that portal. Now if you don't have a portal near you, it will actually create one for you by right clicking. So wherever you're standing right now, if I right clicked it, I would go to the nether. Now also one thing to emphasize is that if you guys think this is cheating just by using this wand to go to your um, nether dimension, don't worry it's not actually cheating because you actually need to go to your nether dimension to get the actual resources needed to craft this. So it's very... Um, very fair to actually have one of these in your vanilla Minecraft, you know, as a mod. So if you right click here, we'll just, since we're far away from any portal, it will actually create its own portal. And it actually made it a uh, kind of messed up portal here, but that's okay. You get some extra obsidian if you want to mine that. And you, you just go into your um, nether portal and there you have it, guys. That's all of the wands. Now let's move on to the last but most important part and possibly the coolest part of this mod is the actual dimension itself. Now to actually make the dimension, like I said, you'll need to place these blocks in a nether, uh, excuse me, nether shape, uh, you know, format as if you were making a nether portal, except using th these blocks. 
Now once you have that, you'll need to get a flint and diamond. Now to make the flint and diamond, you will just use a flint and a diamond to actually uh, craft that. And once you have that in your hand, you cannot use a normal flint and steel, but you have to use this. You just right click on the portal and it will create this blue type effect inside of your portal and whatnot and we just go into that. Okay guys, so once you enter the teleportation dimension, you'll see some clear features. Now, the obvi most obvious feature is actually the trees, which is made out of obsidian for the leaves and the trunks, which are made of cobblestone. Now, they also have some very nice vines hanging from them, which really contrast to the blue and green block available in this actual dimension. Now, also, um, this is home to the Endermen. I came in here a little bit earlier um, on survival mode, and I s actually scared a bunch of them away. So let's fly around and see if we could find any of them. But basically, oh, oh whoa, whoa, there was a lag. But really, all you need, oh, here's our mob, by the way. This is our mob here, which actually when you kill them, they will drop the watching eye. Let's possibly get a sword here to kill them. Let's see a diamond sword. And let's just kill this guy. And oh, he actually disappeared. So it's, um, it has the properties, well, the really abilities of the Enderman. So it's kind of hard to actually kill one of these guys. And I find it's quite annoying. So if you want to actually make your teleportation wand, you, I don't know how you'll be able to kill these guys. But now there's tons of them around and I'm not sure where all the Endermen are. But yeah, usually when you spawn in here initially, there's tons of these um, Endermans around. Well, tons of Endermans around and these guys eventually replace them, which I've come to notice. Um, as well as, like I was saying about what you'll need to actually... Well, what you'll need in this mod mostly is diamonds because diamonds is what you'll actually need to get all of the obsidian if you want to compensate yourself for the loss of obsidian when you're making your wands because you'll need obsidian to make your wands. So anyways guys, that was the actual teleportation mod. I hope you guys enjoyed the mod. Very cool, very quick mod. Adds very um, cool effects, you know, a feeling of a Enderman type world as well as the ability to uh, teleport around just like an Enderman. So um, yeah, also these uh, teleportation wands also work in the... Um, uh, teleportation dimension also um, if you set your spawn with the teleportation wand um, in your overworld it will be relative to your um, teleportation spot in your um, actual dimension so yeah anyways guys remember to drop a like if you like the video it only takes one second to show your support also subscribe if you want to see more videos from me this is team twist and i'll see you guys later